What's up guys, Ben here. And today we're gonna take a look at the CM Storm Trigger Mechanical Keyboard Software. If you're like me and we're lucky enough to go ahead and purchase a mass luminosity uh, edition of the CM Storm Recon Gaming Mouse, then you may be asking yourself, what keyboard can I get to go with it? Me personally, I went with the trigger because I've got a very good deal on it and it also had the cherry black switches which are a bit harder to press down which is what I like because I'm a, I'm a hard typer and I've always uh, put a beating on my keyboards in the past and with my first mechanical keyboard I think I've made the right choice here very happy with it no complaints at all back to the software as you can see you can set up a number of profiles here uh, they give you the quick select ones here five different profiles to go ahead and change uh, to change between for those of you that don't know this software will pretty much let you remap your keys to do different things and that, I mean you could map this M1 key to be the Windows key so every time you hit it your start menu pops up or whatever function that the Windows key would serve at that point will uh, pop up it also comes it really comes in handy I think in um, MMOs and RPG type stuff where you do crafting and stuff so say you've got something you're doing in a game where you know that every time you do this you have to hit the same five keys in the same order what you could go ahead and do is head on over here to the macro studio and now I'm not very good at this but as you can see I set up a test one and what I did is if I set this to say the M1 key every time I hit it it would go ahead and do this macro which would consist of hitting these buttons at these intervals so that it would be L O L D S D F F D S. You see, as you can see, I just hit a bunch of random letters. But all I would have to do is hit the M1 key once, and it would go ahead and go through and do all of these for me, which is very helpful and can save people a lot of time. And if nothing else, a lot of aggravation, really. Instead of having to hit six or seven keys to do something, you can set yourself up a new macro and call it a day. I mean you can also we'll just do a quick test here as you can see we can set up that when you hit record you've got one to one mode actual record the delays between the actions so if you hit L if you just tap in it a bunch of times it'll pop up but if you hit L and then wait five seconds and hit K there'll be that five second interval in there. It also has the speed mode and guard mode which got most zero delays between actions which um, I have no personal use for it because I'm a first person shooter gamer but I do imagine that would come in handy to a lot of games where you have to craft and do uh, maybe create potions or something of that sort if I'll uh, see here we go it was doing it was gonna click stop there we go um, if the five profiles set here are not enough for you you can always of course come to this tab and you can set it up to auto switch between profiles and you can also add new profiles to it um, you can probably set up as many as you eh, it lets you set eh, see if I click it slow I've got up to 14 new profiles here so you could probably set up it probably allows you to set up way more than you actually need. But yeah, on behalf of Game and Tribe, please check out our Facebook page. Also check out the Mass Luminosity Facebook page. Like and share. Be sure to enter our current giveaway for the most powerful gaming computer Mass Luminosity has ever given away. Uh, you won't want to do that. It only takes a few clicks to get entered. It's real easy please like subscribe share all that fun stuff 
and stay tuned as we will have more content, uh, more reviews, more videos coming your way very soon. Thank you.